Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We are five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, folks. And for us traders, it's a three-day holiday. holiday. I love these things. Always do your best. Take action on your ideas. Doing your best means to take action on your ideas. You get many ideas in your head, but without action upon that idea, there'd be no manifestation, no results, and no reward. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 100, NASDAQ off 85, S&P's off 12, gold contract down 590, traded at 1896 an ounce. You got silver up three cents, twenty-three dollars ninety cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up forty cents, ninety-one dollars thirty-six cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The ten-year note up seven six, trading one twenty-six twenty. The thirty-year bond up a full point, plus one tick at one fifty-three. Flat king dollar. King dollars up two hundred and sixty-three ticks, trading ninety-six oh six three. Euro one thirteen, yen one fifteen point zero seven. The British pound one thirty-five to one U.S. dollar. Our phone number is eight seven seven. Nine two seven six six four eight. It was called, folks. When it's going on in your world and the world of the S and P's, let's take a look at it. Here we go. Okay, so we got option expiration happening. It's not quad. So the bottom line is that you'll, you'll get volume, but you're not going to get a huge amount of volume. Okay, so let's get this active contract up. We'll go intraday. My take is that we're going to run into the close, meaning run higher into the close, folks. So let's see what we got. We got down to 41.21. We got, oh, look at this. Here we go. Yep, here we go. We got an ABC up. I love it. Okay, so B point 374, A point 321. Sweet. Okay, so you got a, uh, what's that? 50, 50, what did I say? Three? 374, yeah. 54. That gives us, uh, hey, this is going to be interesting, man. That's fucking, that's wild. Hold on one second. Let me make sure I get that right. 374, the low, yeah, 321. Holy cow, man, this has some range. That, you know what that's saying, folks? That's saying that this, that this ABC, whether it's today or on Monday, this say, ABC is saying that we're going to 4,400 inside that uh, the s and NQ, so let's take a look at the NQ, see if they, they line up. Because what we've done is this, you're coming down to the low end, you have tremendously lighter volume. We had it yesterday, it looks like we're even gonna have lighter volume today. And that sets up a bounce when the whole world probably is shot in this thing right now and worrying. And guess what? The, the world is an ending, folks. Okay, so, yep, it's an ABC. Okay, this is a big one. 136, well actually that's 14,136, 13,000, 900, so it's 246, 246 A to B, 288. So we're at 14,102, 14,288 is the number. So this is how this works, folks, okay? So, you know, <laughs> you get a picture, man. When I've looked at these 10 minute charts, okay, I'm, I'm going on now, I'm like, oh my God, I can't even think about how many years. Bottom line goes like this. When you get an ABC structure like this, right, we have plenty of time that that could fulfill today. If we don't, this is something to keep in mind on Monday, so uh, Tuesday. So let's picture, on picture that you don't get it today. And then picture on Tuesday that what has happened, if you look at this S&P or you look at the NASDAQ, and it actually gets under the B point. The bottom line, folks, the buy. Um, that's one scenario. It goes like that. The, the other scenario is that we just get it right now. They just run it right into the close. So we'll see where this baby shakes out. We'll, if we go through the indices, what you're going to see is this. We look at the SPY. You're going to see the SPY here. We've done 88 million shares. Now it's taken a swing point out of 123. That's on Monday. If it can't even get more shares than that, that isn't what you're going against. What you're going against is you're going against 252 million shares. So... Thus far, you get a rejection of lower price. You'd want the SPY to close inside of 435.34. Right now, we're 30 cents above it. We look at the NDX 100. What do you have with the NDX? Three Qs. We bring the three Qs up. Monday, 
we had 80 million. You're at 61. That can do 80 million. We'll see whether you know it does it or not. That being said, you're still going into 199 million. You're going into 106. That's telling me that guess what? Qs are even going topside. Gold, gold contract here. This isn't a confirmed ABC structure on the way up. You blew away the B point yesterday. You blew it away with volume. Let me pull this up. There we go. Okay, you're gonna see the B point on gold was uh, 1881. We had 215,000 contracts. We blew that away yesterday with 260. That is 101 A to B, which gets you a price projection of 1946. What's going to be intriguing now with the gold market is this. And this is how deviant gold is sometimes. We'll see. We'll see whether the run's just going to keep going. Or, in fact, will the dollar basically try to get higher again? Right now it's up 273. You know, it's held price out here today. So it's like, okay, it wants to go to the top of 96.45. We'll see how that shakes out. If, if gold, well, you get two different things. Of course, A to B equals C to D. Most a ABC structures are straight line moves on the way up. If it turns into a complex ABC, what happens is that it'll pull back with lighter volume. What ends up then is that it'll go under the B point, setting up a complex ABC structure on the way up, and then you go topside in a monster way. Now, either way, it's a, it's a cool setup. Notes and bonds, whole different ball game, folks. Notes and bonds out here. We take a look at notes and bonds. You got notes and bonds, a building cause for lower price. You take a look at this note and bond market right now. You get the 10 year up eight ticks. You have 1.5 million contracts traded. You know, it hasn't tested these lows yet with uh, 3.1 million contracts traded. So bottom line, this is more than likely, yeah, I can see the bond market maybe getting to 127. That's the 10 year. But notes and bonds went lower price. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading down 110 NASDAQ. Down 96. SP's off 14. Come right back.